Gosnell, a true crime drama about abortion provider Kermit Gosnell, has cracked the top ten at the box office, much to the delight of anti-abortion activists. As the Daily Caller reports, the film, whose complete title is Gosnell, The Trial of America's Biggest Serial Killer, came in at number 10 in weekend box office receipts, with total receipts of an estimated $1.235 million. By comparison, the big box office winner this weekend was Venom, according to Box Office Mojo, which brought in an estimated $35.7 million. That the obscure film, produced by two filmmakers who turned to crowdfunding to raise money for the film, made the top 10 at all is nothing short of miraculous, writes Daily Caller writer Carrie Pickett, considering the barriers the filmmakers faced in getting publicity for the film. For example, Facebook refused to allow the film to be promoted on its platform. National Public Radio, NPR, refused to even discuss it, purportedly because the film's promotional material uses the words abortionist and abortion doctor. The book on which the movie was based was deliberately kept off of the New York Times bestseller list, despite what Pickett calls its successful sales. Even the judge in the Kermit Gosnell case sued to stop its release.